Alrighty guys, just got to do a quick tutorial on how to overclock your monitor and uh, recently I've overclocked my monitor and I told my friends that I'd done it and uh, they'd be like What? You talking shit now? You can't overclock your monitor, fool! But yep, you can and I'm going to show you how. Basically what I'm doing is overclocking the monitor to, uh, well I got an extra 17 hertz in my monitor, you might not think that's a lot but because I play with vertical sync on in Battlefield 3, that means I'm locking my frames to my refresh rate on my monitor, which is 60 hertz. So I'm getting 60 frames with vertical sync on. So, uh, but now I'm playing with I'm playing at 77 frames because I've overclocked the monitor to 77 hertz. If that makes sense. Well, anyway, um, I think this only works with N Nvidia graphics cards. I don't think you can do it with other cards. I might be totally wrong. I just I'm, I think you can only do it with Nvidia, I'm not sure. But anyway, here you go. You click the little arrow at the side there, click the Nvidia tab, control panel, you go to change resolution, and you can see there I've got means at 77 hertz, and this is a 60 hertz monitor, and there's a custom tab. You go to, you go to customize, there's there. You go to create custom resolution, you go to refresh rate, and mine's is at 77. I'm not going to change mine because I don't want to fuck it up because it took a couple of attempts to get it to work right. But basically, I would go to 90 hertz. I wouldn't push push any further than 90 hertz. Start at 90 hertz, test, and if your screen goes black for like, I don't know, two or three seconds, then it's not worked. So then you want to start working your way down from 90. Probably just go to 85 and test, then 80 and test. When I got to 80, I started going down by one hertz. And I eventually got to 77 hertz test, and it was successful. And then you click apply, and then that's you got your extra your extra hertz. But you might be lucky; it's different for different monitors. You might get 90 or 85 or 80. I only got well, I say only got 77, but as I said before, I'll take those extra 17 frames in Battlefield all day, all day long. So uh, basically, that's it. Oh, uh, you do it at your own risk if. Anything goes wrong with your monitor, the, the, the manufacturer might be. If he knows that you've done this, then you might uh, expire your warranty, or there may be other risks. But I, I, I don't think there will be any problems with it. That, that's the whole point of doing the test to just push, just uh, increase the power, just that little bit more to see what extra you can get. I think it will be fine. It'll be all good. But be warned, do it at your own risk. Nothing to do with me if it breaks. You're like, no, you fuck that monitor, motherfucker. Give me some money for a new monitor. But yeah, that's it guys, if there's any questions, uh, just leave in the comment and I'll get back to you and I'll catch you all later.